Yo guys, it's Big Granny here. Welcome back to Doge Tycoon. So I believe I'm going to finish this pretty soon because, uh, you know, we're on the second floor already. We can already buy a research center, which we're going to get the Snow Doge for 160k. I know that's a lot of money. And it's probably going to be terrible to afford those cells and producers. As long as those producers make a lot of money, I think I'm going to be off to a good road. So, I mean, it didn't really take too long to save up 160k anyway. I'm earning pretty decent money, and hopefully these cells... Make pretty good money. Alright. Kind of reminds me of Miner's Haven when I think of cells. Because, you know, just took up them up to um, upgraders and stuff like that. Or droppers. Holy smokes. Okay, the cell isn't bad, but the producers are really bad. Holy crap. How am I going to afford this? <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to AFK a lot, guys. <laughs> Even the cell's going to take some time. The producers... I wonder if I should save 300k for the first producer, or to just go all out and go for the 450k one. I think that's the most expensive item in this game. Oh my god. Holy Jesus, that's expensive. I really need to start making games and start becoming a developer. Problem is, I just rather do YouTube videos. I just, you know, it's being productive, so whatever. Alright, so we're just going to save up for that sell so far. Um, hope you guys... Why am I... Why did I just try to attempt to do my intro? Stupid me. That's when you that's when you know I woke up like two hours ago. <laughs> I like uh, my hair looks like a peacock when I wake up, like all my hair is just everywhere. I don't have long hair, it's just it's just like all sticking out. It's like, like like a dead raccoon, you know what I'm saying? Alright. I feel like I'm still laying in bed with this chair, it's awesome. So, in the upcoming weeks. Once I turn 18 and stuff, which some people are like, oh, you're 18, you play Roblox. Well, I'm not 18 yet, but whatever. I mean, there's adults that play Roblox. Most of the developers are actually, like, pretty mature people, and they're either teenagers or adults. And I don't know why it's such a big stereotype on Roblox, but it's partially because they're children, but I don't know. It's, it's just, it just gets really annoying sometimes. I feel bad for some of those people, too, like... They're like, oh, you're 30 years old and play Roblox. I mean, as long as you're not creeping on children, I don't. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> Which there are people that are on Roblox that creep on people like that. It's it's pretty scary. And oh god, let's not talk about ODers, please. Please no. I hate I hate being reminded reminded of that cancer. And also, people are like, oh, you should play Roblox High School. I'm just like, nope. Unless if I'm doing a trolling video, I do not want to play that game because it's. Not only is it a pretty bad game, I mean, it's got some cool role-playing aspects and actually has, like, some cool housing and cars, but that's about it. And it's just literally, it's literally popular because people OD on it. There's nothing else that people do on it. I mean, it, it, there's not really anything fun to do in it, necessarily. I mean, I have role-played before. Not, like, on my date, but I actually role-played, uh, like, many, many years ago when I was, like, younger, when I was, like, 12 or 11 on Roblox. I was, like, went to these, like, sci-fi games that we role-played and had, like, a pretend, like, ship and sci-fi. That, that role-play lasted, like, two hours, and I love role-playing with those people. Like, oh, let's go get resources, let's go sleep, whatever. And I never talk to those people again, but it was, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> you know, just kind of... Well, play is such a waste of time, in my opinion. Well, so is playing games, but making videos isn't a waste of time. But um, it's kind of just talk. I don't know. I guess if you're making friends while you're at it, I guess. I don't know. Just, just random trash is coming out of my head right now. <laughs> Everybody's probably like, "Oh, what is, what is wrong with Big Granny today?" All right, whatever. All right. I think I'm gonna save up 450k for that producer. I'm expecting it'll make $1,000 per drop. I hope it does. If it makes more than that, I will be freaking happy. If it makes a little bit less, eh. It makes a lot more. I'm guessing it's going to make more than 1000 That's That's my prediction. I don't know. People in the comments, you probably know already because you've played through this game. But I thought that was a button there for a second. I was like, oh, can I click this? It seriously looks like a button. And a little bit, I'm a little bit disappointed at this conveyor system right here in terms of droppers, but that's all right. All these droppers are the same. Well, there's some very minor differences. Very, very minor. Well, they're different droppers, but they, they, they're just, they're just minor changes. 
color changes and stuff like that. I mean, the design looks a little bit different, but it's pretty much it pretty much looks almost the same. So I can't really say they copy and paste it. That's not really true. All right, we're almost there. We're two thirds of the way there. All right, so I haven't explored the map yet. That's something I don't do in my videos that I'm lacking in. Really apologize for that. I don't. I always forget about exploring maps because some tycoons actually have some cool maps. I actually kind of like the map of this tycoon. Um, got like a waterfall right here with the doge shooting out water. He's also he's, it's okay, guys. He's not actually shooting out water. He's puking water. Uh, oh yeah, let's take a let's take a bath in the do the doge water. Oh yeah. Now, how does the doge have so much water? By the way, I just wonder that. I mean, it makes sense if it was a doge statue. I don't think it's a statue though, because it's not like stone or anything. It's a nice use of cobblestone for the walls too. I didn't know cobblestone looked good as walls. Never actually noticed that. It it looks better if you use the dark theme map. And I also like the color of the grass and the trees. It's got like doge particle effects coming out of the trees everywhere. Kind of looks cool. Let's see how crappy this looks if I lower my graphics. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh god, it looks bad. Some people are gonna be like, oh, you can't really tell the difference. Well. In my perspective, I mean, with a YouTube video, it's slightly lower quality, but there's no anti-leasing, there's no shadows, there's no lights. It's just very lacking, especially in high detail stuff. And also with that graphics card upgrade I was talking about, um, I can already almost max out every game I play, and I have an R9 270X, which is a pretty mid-end card. And once I get that GTX 1080, I will be pretty much top of the line all over the place. And I think they're in stock. They're slightly over... Whoa, purchase legendary doge. Huh. Okay. Oh, 1,000 doge cash. I was exactly right. I don't know how I got that right. I promise I did not see it. I got that right. Because I was guessing, well, these things make 200. And, you know, after a while, I bet it'll make 1,000 at some point. So, yeah, we're making money a lot quicker now. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get the rest of these producers up here. This thing probably makes more money than everything else combined. <laughs> it's kind of worth it, actually. All right, Legendary Doge is $1 million. That's going to be a uh, pain to save up for. Also, um, in terms of basic tycoons, I, uh, one of the recent tycoons I played on my channel is called Kingdom Development Tycoon. That was actually a cool tycoon. Besides the guards killing me over and over again, I really did not appreciate that. That was that got really annoying. I was like, hi, bandits. Boom. Just get shot by my guard. I'm just like, uh. Started, started crying and whimpering. I'm just kidding. Um, man. I want to start doing face cam too. Problem is, I just have a really bad recording environment. Like, lighting sucks. I and mean, if you watch my face reveal video, I mean, you can, you can really see that my lighting is really bad. <laughs> I mean, I got like these yellow lights in the background and my ceiling, and it just shines on the camera. It looks like there's a sun behind me. <laughs> my camera's pretty bad too. I and mean, it works okay. People won't really mind it. If I'm doing videos though, I want everything to be high quality. That way people can't complain about it. Which I think typically people don't mind if it's 720p, at least. Um, I mean, I've seen 480p videos, people don't really mind it. Uh, 360p, you will see a lot of complaints. 480p, I think you'll see them every once in a while. Um, but yeah, keep your videos at least 720p. It's really easy to upload it to, because 1080p 60fps takes me about 2-3 to three hours to upload a video. The larger ones, sometimes even 4 hours. Um, like that Subnautica episode. Episode 1 is like a 40 minute episode. That took me 6 hours to upload. I compressed it down, so it took me about an hour and a half or 2 hours. Yeah, I'm using a compressor now, which, it's just a teeny bit lower quality, and I used to have audio issues with it, but I fixed that now, and, you know, recently a new mic. This mic is still kind of meh, but, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, Big Granny, why didn't you get a studio mic, blah, blah, blah. Well, you know, I just, I just have background noise, I have, like, a mother that works next to me in the next room. That's partially why I don't do videos in the, during the day, because she works down here. That's why I like recording at night and stuff. That's the thing, when I get back on schedule, I'm going to have a hard time recording again. Shoot, I didn't, I didn't think about that. Ooh, 700 doge cash. Cool. I'm going to make some quick cash now. I need my money and I need it now. <laughs> Alright. And 
in this whole entire second episode, I apologize for this. We only got to sell in two droppers. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll, we'll, make, we'll try to get some more stuff pretty soon here. Um, instead of trying to save up for these all the time, I'm going to go ahead and spice this up a little bit. Get a Galaxy Doge dropper. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. It's like a little teleporter here. I'm really kind of impressed with the animations. Oh, yeah, these are these are a lot cheaper. Holy smokes. All right. That's going to do us a lot better. But before we get those sales, guys, we're going to end the episode here. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Leave some comments. I thank you guys so much for supporting my channel. We're becoming a long way. I'd like to reach 100,000 subscribers. That's my goal right now. I want to reach it before the end of August. I know. I know. I sound like I'm just, like, trying to, like, just, uh, like, get as far as I can to just inflate my channel. You know, but I just want to reach my goals before school starts back up because I promise when school starts back up, it's going to be hard to make videos. The cool thing about being at school, though, is that I can bring my laptop there and upload videos because my school's internet is insanely fast. I mean, they use light speed, so they get, like, 10 gigs down and 10 gigs up um, per second. But they, they limit upload to, like, 80 megs a second and download to, like, 2 Otherwise, their networks would be overloaded. So I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Love you all. That's going to be it. Let's start with another episode.